Hey everyone, Ryan here with another 2022 Topps Archive Signature Series. Um, I have five boxes today we're going to open up. So if you watched the first video, you know that these are encased buyback autographs of active players currently in the MLB. Um, hopefully we can find a one-on-one -one in here of uh, one of the game's top players. Uh, pulled a Tim Anderson and a Zach Wheeler so far, so decent luck. These run about 90 bucks a piece, so hopefully we get our value back. Uh, should be a pretty quick video, so stick with it to the end to see what we can get. Hoping I can pull a judge. That would be great to add to my collection. Or a Trout 1 of 1 or Otani 1 of 1. So these are going to be pretty quick reveals. And if I can get the box open. First box. Joe Musgrove. All right. So you have a Joe Musgrove Topps Heritage card, numbered 55 out of 71. Musgrove's put together a decent career so far, so pretty nice. Box number two. Again, I really like a judge add to my collection. I do not have a judge autograph. All I, I do have a judge autographed Sports Illustrated issue, which is pretty cool. It's a gift to me. But uh would like to add a card, especially if it comes out of a box that I open instead of having to just purchase it. That'd be great. So number two is, that's a nice one, Tyler Glasnow on the Rays. That's from Topps opening day. And that's number eight out of 67. So that's a nice on-card auto, Tyler Glasnow. If he can get his uh, injury straightened out, that would be good. He'd be a... Good pitcher for a long time if you can just stay healthy. On to box number three. Would like to pull a one of one. I'm still waiting to pull another one of one. Pulled one in my life. It was Adalberto Mondesi, so hoping to find another one. And box number three, another Tim Anderson. So that's my second Tim Anderson I pulled out of these. This one's low numbered. This is another Topps Heritage. So, Topps Heritage, Tim Anderson, 22 out of 24. So, another nice-looking card. So, I'm increasing my Tim Anderson collection. Invest now in Tim Anderson. Right here. Box number four. So, two left. See what we can get out of here. And a Starling Marte Topps Bunt. And that is 1 out of 21. I don't think I've ever seen this card before. So a Starling Marte, 1 of 21. Tops Bunt, 17. Looks like. 2017. It's an interesting looking card from his time on the Pirates. Now with the Mets. Starling Marte. Not exactly a bunch of bangers out of these boxes, but we got one left and that's all it takes, so... Last box. I got some more of this coming in too. This is a fun, easy product to open and good possibilities. So I think I have some more of this coming in. Last box. Jose Abreu, one of one. There we go. A one of one Jose Abreu on card auto. Wow. One of one. It looks like he's got some kind of inscription down there. Maybe that's just how his auto is. Oh, with his number. Number 79. Jose Abreu, one of one. Bowman, that is 2021. So that is after his MVP season. He won the MVP that year? I believe he did. He did, uh, I believe... Yeah, I think he won the MVP that year. I could be wrong with that. Let me know in the comments. I'll look into it and put it in the description. But, wow. Jose Abreu, one of one. Super pumped about that. Awesome hit. I said I wanted to pull another one one and here we go. Jose Abreu, great player for the White Sox. Nice looking card. Drop a comment, let me know what you think, what you guys are pulling out of this, but I'm I'm really happy with that. That's so awesome. Right there, one of one. Uh, more stuff on the way, guys. Really appreciate you watching. Um, please like and subscribe for more content. And as always, thank you guys.